Hey everybody, um, welcome back to my channel. I have another book today. This is the best of Color It. Um, I have to say that I was on the fence about these books for a long time. Um, only because at the price point they were very, very expensive for a coloring book. I think it was like $15, $16.99, something like that. And I could not see paying that much money for a coloring book, to be honest. So, um, I, on Facebook, I believe, um, I had like a little ad pop up on my screen and it said that they were selling the best of books for $4.99 with 30 pictures and I was like well wow that's a great way to try it out let me see um I really 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 did not want to like these books <laughs> because of the price but I have to say that the quality is one of the best quality coloring books I have ever seen I don't even know um how they sell them for $15 now to be honest with you but anyways um it's, it's a beautiful book. It's hard band, um, not hard band, hard covered with a spiral at the top, which is great if you're right or left handed. Um, the cover is made of very sturdy cardboard. This is going to be a little awkward to, um, to show. I'm going to have to go back and forth a little bit. Um, in this book in particular, you get 30 pictures. I believe it's three from um, all of their books. Um, let's see, we got the name page, they got some tips, here it is. Right here they show you kind of like a little index. Um, say you're coloring this Eiffel Tower and you really like it, you can go to this book and that's where you'll find this image and you can go purchase it if you don't want to, you know buy all the books whatever um, I really like how they did that it's, it's, it's very helpful so you don't have to you know go look for them it's just really really cute I love the doodles the myth mythical and fantasy was the one I think I'm gonna purchase um, maybe the ocean one this is a blotter to be put under your pages you know but during my testing, I have not seen anything bleed through, and I have used watercolor, neos, I've used um, alcohol inks, <sighs> pretty much you name it, and I've, I've tried it, and I just haven't seen anything bleed through. <laughs> just wait a little bit. Here's one of the doodle pages, and the pages feel like shiny, but it's very, very smooth when you're coloring it. It's like butter. Some mandalas, iguanas. This is the one that I started testing on. Um, these are alcohol markers. Um, this is, I don't know if you can see the shine. Yeah, I love it. These are the new, uh, well, new to me, flare glitter gel pens works great really shiny this is a cheapy brand on um, pe color pencil this is a medium um, price color pencil and this is a more expensive um, color pencil and I couldn't tell any difference between how good and smooth that they went on they were all just really beautiful this is the tritone core colors and this one, I don't know why it did that. It's kind of scratchy looking. I couldn't get this one to work. This was a um, a really, I thought it was good on other pages. These are the lollies. I used the pink lollies. And it just did not want to write. I don't know if it's, because uh, it's kind of waxy. Maybe it's a wax base. I don't know. But it did not want to work on this tester page. And you can see nothing at all bled through. Alright. <clears throat> we got like Zen Doodle Animals. Some more doodles. This fairy, I mean, is gorgeous. Look how pretty she is. We got some more animals. I like pages like this. The whimsical. I'm not really into this kind of doodle stuff but you know I'm, I'm gonna try one 
I don't like mandalas that much, so I don't know if I'll do all those. But that's just personal preference. It has nothing to do with the book. This page is really cute, and it would be adorable with markers, with my alcohol markers. This picture is going to be really nice when I'm done. This is the one I was working on last night. Um, I actually got to use this um, color special effects book. I'm not sure what page it's on, but in here she shows you um, how to do the mushrooms. And right here she shows you how to do the mushrooms step by step. I um, actually did a review on this book too. You can um, find that um, on my channel. But I like how it came out. It came out pretty good for my first time. Um, using different mediums here, different gel pens and get that shine thing going on. But it's very, very silky paper and it's very easy to color on. No um, scratches, no white stuff staying around. Like the, the, it's just a great, great um, paper. It's amazing, and I really did not want to like this one. Um, this is one they did live <clears throat> a couple of weeks back. I didn't have the book yet, but I've seen a bunch of people uh, show this one on the internet. This is really pretty. Parrots. Cute little kitten. I wish they had less of these, to be honest. This is from the Myth book. Dolphin. This one is Little Sweet Treats Cupcakes. And that's it. That's the last page. Um, it's really great to sit up in your bed or watch the TV. And it's just so sturdy. You can sit there and call. You don't need anything else. Put on a pillow. I love it. It's great. So, with that being said, I eat my words because I did not want to like these books. But I really, really do like it. Um... I'm not going to go crazy and buy all of them one time. Maybe I'll wait for some more sales. <laughs> or maybe the prices will come down a little bit. But um, <clears throat> it's a really, really good quality book. And to the, um, the best of regular price, I believe, was like $10. So maybe start with this one and work your way up. See how you like it before you spend all the money to get the other books. I'll... Um, see if I can find a link to see where you can purchase it and put it down at the bottom. And that's about it. If you have any questions or comments, please leave it down in the comment box. And um, I will try to link this where I purchased it at in the description box. And um, please like and subscribe. I would really appreciate it. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.